when an illegal dump was discovered on one of the hills overlooking the river. Subsequent investigation by the board revealed that the dump also contained elevated levels of hazardous wastes. Most of the contamination came from uh, old batteries. Lead is predominantly the uh, constituent that we're looking at, although there is some uh, spots where we've had hits on zinc and mercury, and I'm not sure what the source of those would be. But lead, it, it's obvious uh, from the number of broken batteries that have been uh, uncovered and segregated from uh, the wastes uh, that that's where the lead came from. 30 years of illegal dumping and then burning household trash on the hillside resulted in approximately 900 cubic yards of lead contaminated burn ash and soil concentrated into an 8 to 24 inch layer below the visible household waste. Unfortunately, cleaning up the site wasn't simple. The trash was spread across three acres on an extremely steep slope that rendered most traditional cleanup methods unfeasible. The unique system that the California Integrated Waste Management Board devised to tackle the job was a hybrid, specifically developed for extreme gradients. We removed all the material on the bottom, staged that out, and then at that time we started uh, excavating out the bottom, and created benches to work our way up to the slope, to about, well, about a third of the slope up. Then, utilizing two bulldozers, one tethered to the other via a heavy cable and winch system, which acted as a safety and pullback line, the trash was pushed two-thirds of the way down the hill, where it could be safely handled in a more conventional manner. You have one on the side of the hill, the other one is cabled to it. It's kind of a, a yo-yo system between the two. Um, it's, it's very effective in getting the material off of extremely steep slopes, and it's a very safe way of doing it. Um, it's, it basically, it removes the material within a very short amount of time. After enough material was stockpiled near the bottom of the slope, the debris was moved down the remainder of the hill using more traditional techniques.